Hey everyone, the Game Piece here. Welcome back to another video. Today I wanted to go over an update that Temtem has shared on Twitter regarding the upcoming housing feature. We know that this should be coming any day now. At this point, it is going to be included in the PCWA patch cycle. So the fact that they are teasing it more and more frequently definitely means that it might be on the horizon. So let's get right into the screenshot they shared as well as some additional information. So taking a look at the main screenshot here, we're going to go from left to right as far as these categories go and kind of speculate on what could be included in them. So the first one we're going to take a look at is the housing one here. It looks like it might include some wallpaper as well as flooring in it. Or maybe you could even change the overall exterior of your house. I wonder if you are able to buy some different exteriors like um, to fit the themes of the different islands like the Denny's houses or the, the Amnesian houses or the Tugma houses that might be interesting but we'll just have to wait and see for that. Uh, moving on to the next category though it looks like we're going to be able to buy appliances things like refrigerators, stoves, things like that. Maybe this will also include like smaller appliances like toasters, blenders. And then on to the next category we have wardrobes. It looks like this will also include like tables, end tables. And then the next one we see here is the one that's actually selected and highlighted and this one is called furniture. Now this will probably include your chairs, your sofas, all of your sort of lounging furniture. I'm wondering if there will be some like benches and stuff. And maybe, I wonder if there will actually be a way to customize, like, the outside of your house in addition to the inside. So maybe there will be, like, some outside additions as well. But um, that looks like that will be the furniture tab there. And then the next one will be the rug or carpeting tab, it looks like. Uh, you'll be able to place various rugs in your house and hopefully be able to resize those and things like that to be able to make them look bigger and more fitting to the area that you're trying to create. And then the next tab will be, I'm assuming it's going to be a miscellaneous tab. Uh, we do know that there will be like plushies that we can buy of various Temtem from the trailer. We know that there's a plushie for Pig Epic and a plushie for Saku, at least going by the trailer. So we know that those will be hopefully housing items in addition to maybe some other Temtem as well. So it looks like this might be a miscellaneous tab, but if not, it looks like it will just be like a succulent tab or like a plant tab. And then for the last option there, it looks like this will maybe be a placing features so if you select that tab it looks like you might be able to place the items in your house or what I was also thinking is maybe this could be a customization feature so what I was thinking is maybe you could use like dye packs on these cosmetic items to make them more customizable even and also kind of add another benefit to having a dye pack just to use them on your cosmetic items is nice but once you have your glamour kind of set up you don't really want to change it so this would just be another avenue to use those dye packs and customize things even further. So that's what I was thinking that those two options could maybe be. And then getting into the next bit of information was a question that I saw asked on Twitter that revealed a little bit more info. Uh, they asked, can you tell us if there will be any features in housing related to more than just cosmetic purposes? So basically asking if they will have any sort of like in-game benefit rather than just for looks. So uh, they actually replied and said, um, for the first few iterations, housing will be cosmetic only simply a way of flexing on people but um, that sounds like in the future there will be features that will provide benefits to in-game. I know that personally I thought I saw it thrown around the fact that we would be able to grow fruit trees um, like the ones that will hold enhancer fruits for TV training or the reducer fruits for TV training um, or maybe even like the candy trees in the future but I guess we'll just have to wait and see. I think having a garden feature would be really cool or maybe even something like a crafting feature but like I said, we'll just have to wait and see what comes in the future. The first iteration looks to be very um, basic and cosmetic oriented, like this tweet seems to imply. So definitely keep your expectations in line with that. And uh, just know that we should be getting this any day now. They are teasing it. And when they do tease things more frequently, it definitely means that something is on the horizon. So hopefully it won't be too long before we get this housing feature. But let me know what you guys are most excited about for housing. Let me know in the comments below what are you most looking forward to. Hopefully we get this sooner rather than later, you guys. But thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. And if you did, please feel free to leave a like and subscribe for more 1010 content in the future. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys have a great weekend.